Welcome back to Animal Kingdom where curiosity meets the wild. Today we're splashing into the world of one of the most familiar ducks on the planet, the Mallard Duck. You've probably seen these ducks paddling around city ponds, rivers, and lakes. But there's more to them than just a friendly quack. The Mallard is a medium-sized dabbling duck, and it's one of the most widespread ducks in the world. Male mallards are easy to spot with their shiny green head, bright yellow bills, and a ring of white around their neck. Females look completely different covered in brown speckled feathers that help them camouflage perfectly in tall grass and weeds. This difference between males and females is called sexual dimorphism, and it helps protect nesting females from predators. Mallards are dabbling ducks which means instead of diving deep, they tip forward with their tails sticking up while they feed in shallow water. They eat a little bit of everything plant, seeds, insects, and even small fish if they get the chance. Mallards are also opportunistic, meaning they'll happily snack on bread from people toss, though natural foods are much healthier for them. You might be surprised to know that mallards are the ancestors of nearly all domestic ducks in the world. They've been around people for so long that many farm and backyard ducks trace their roots back to the wild mallard. During the breeding season, male mallards put on a show calling loudly, splashing, and showing off their bright feathers to impress the females. Once a female chooses her mate, she builds a nest on the ground usually hidden in grass, near water, or even in backyards and gardens. She lays 8 to 13 eggs, and she alone takes care of incubating them for almost a month. When the ducklings hatch, they're covered in yellow down and are ready to leave the nest within a single day. These little ducklings with the coastal meaning they can walk, swim, and feed themselves almost immediately after hatching. Still, they stick close to their mother for protection, often forming an adorable line behind her as they paddle across the water. Predators like foxes, raccoons, hawks, and snapping turtles are always a danger, so staying together as a group helps them survive. Mallards are incredible flyers too, reaching speeds of up to 70 kilometers per hour when migrating. They travel thousands of kilometers between their summer breeding grounds in the north and their winter homes in the south. Mallards also play a big role in wetland ecosystems by eating plants and insects and spreading seeds through their droppings. They're even known to hybridize with other duck species, creating unique mixes of colors and patterns in their offspring. The familiar quacking view is almost always from the female male mallards make softer, raspier calls. And here's a fun fact when mallards sleep, they often float on the water, resting one side of their brain at a time so they can stay alert for danger. Whether gliding across a compound, dabbling for food, or guiding a trail of ducklings, the mallard duck is one of nature's most adaptable and resilient birds. So next time you see one, remember you're looking at a bird with a history that connects wild wetlands to your own backyard. Thanks for joining us on today's adventure with the mallard duck, one of the world's most familiar yet fascinating waterfowl. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe for more wild adventures. And we'll see you next time where curiosity meets the wild.